Next of Kin is uh, a family drama and it shows the effects of terrorism, but on uh, how it affects a family that are kind of closely related to it and um, what happens to them um, throughout and after, really. My character's Rahana, and I am the in-law of um, Archie's character, which is Mona, and my husband dies earlier on, and um, my stepson, who is from Kareem's earlier marriage, is, uh, turns out that he's kind of involved in, in the death of my husband, and uh, yeah, so that's who she is. She's from uh, Wakefield, up north. Rihanna changes as the show goes on, as do all the characters, I think. They all develop. Um, it's quite devastating what happens um, and the effects of that. I just think her whole outlook on life changes, um, the circumstances of what's happened to her and her family, um, the way she's lost her husband, and what happens, what her stepson is then involved in. Uh, it's a massive shock. And I think she just questions a lot of things. And yeah, and, and her relationship, I think actually she grows closer to her in-laws, which prior to that, she wasn't, she didn't really have much of a relationship with them. I actually didn't know much about it before I, uh, before I, was involved in this project. Um, I only knew loosely um, what it was about. And yeah, of course I was excited by the script because I think it's very relevant, it's very current. And with like any drama, it, there's always stuff to come to the surface and just stuff to be explored. And I feel like this, we never ever really, especially for example in the news today, we never really explore we only ever see one side, and I think everything in life is three-dimensional, and we should try and explore all of that as much as we can. I'm very careful with what, what, especially if it is like hot subjects like now, terror-related, for example, with what kind of work I want to do, and I have to believe in it. And I did. I was touched actually by this story because, in in sometimes it may seem like oh, such a simple story of this family that get affected and what happens, or maybe a marriage breaks down and so on and so forth, and a lot of questions aren't answered. But that to me was is a, is a touching story, and I just I was excited by it, and I was hoping that it was going to be really real and raw. What makes this unique is that it focuses more on the effects of the family and how it how it can either make or break them really. And usually terror focus shows are on how who the terrorists are and how and why they become terrorists. And it's not really about that. So that's what makes this unique. I think that was definitely Justin Chadwick, who's, who likes to, the, the director of the first three episodes, um, he likes to work from a very real and raw perspective. Um, and that's definitely something that I absolutely love. There are a lot of in-jokes in the family. I'm not involved that much in the in-jokes because, well, uh, the character, Rahana's not really that close in the beginning, let's say. so. There are, and I think that's very important to show that, the, the, the real and raw side, because there are, even in the darkest times, you find humour, and, and I think that's very important. That kind of is what gets us through life, isn't it? Yes, it is important with um, having this three-dimensional side. I don't feel like it's something that we see, necessarily, especially on the news. Um, we, we just don't get to be see that side and, and the effects it has on families, society, friends, um, unless there is like a massive riot or something. So yeah, I think it, it's absolutely important that the viewers get at least get a chance or an insight to see how that might affect a family and yeah, and people.
what would I like the audience to to think about or possibly have in their mind going forward? That there are so many factors in things like terrorism. You know, it's it's never actually just I don't think just one dimensional. And, and I think, for example, you know, there are there's government involvement, there's political involvement, there's personal like there's so many things, and I don't think people really ever have the answer in, in terms of why it's happening for example in this family we never they never really get to know why and it wasn't really a religious thing he just kind of gets caught up in this thing and wants to get out of it so yeah i i think just bearing in mind that it affects people massively but there is there is definitely always another side to it and um there's always many factors involved